Welcome Aries, this is the month of October reading. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Now, Aries, oh my God. Aries, 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 let's see what is your major. I see hostility is here. And I see happy family, but there's hostility. And I see it take a leap. So your general energy is Aries is 26, which is 8, a whole, whole lot of hostility. Um, yep. And um, a happy family take the lead. Now, 8, 3, and 4 is your energy vibration number. So when hostility come up, it's, uh, you Aries are going to be dealing with a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff. Um, what is going to be transpiring is a lot of stuff that is going to go on. There's a lot of hostility that is going to be coming in. Um, take the lead. Um, the number three card is here. And happy family um, is here also. Now there is some really um, deceptive play that is going on Aries whether you are connected or you are part of it. So when the energy of hostility come, a whole lot of hostility is coming at you, Aries, and there is going to be um, some sort of a situation with the family, but take the lead as to what is happening and what is transpiring in your world. So you have to go back and look at the general reading to see what is transpiring. So I see they're going to be finding out uh, um, we have uh, the energy of water in uh, the first week, uh, the energy of water and debt in the second week. Uh, the wheel of fortune is coming up in the third week and the fourth week we have the energy of the fool. And there is some sort of a deceptiveness that is coming out about a whole lot of money. People are finding out the truth of what has happened and what has transpired. Now, what we're looking at, um, the first two weeks is hair Aries. So hair and fire doesn't really work. You can see that the first two weeks is not going to be that pleasant. The second um, two weeks is not going to be that pleasant because they're going to be finding out about uh, um, a Aquarian Gemini or Libra person that has done some sort of a deceptiveness is in um, an Aquarian, whoever this Aquarian is, has done some sort of deceptiveness. And I see truths is going to be coming out. There's a lot of uh, untruths that was told and a lot of deceptive play that was told and it is coming out. So um, they're going to be finding out that someone has used their powers in the wrong way and has created some sort of a uh, issue that is coming out in the first week the second week a cycle is going to be over debt is coming no new start um some of you are ruined then in um the fourth week judgment call i see some of you have to return a whole lot of money and then in the fourth week the star i see some sort of a situation is going to be coming out when people are going to be finding out some sort of a play that was happened and transpired so as we look at the energy is that some of you um, Aries are dealing with an Aquarian, Gemini or a Libran person. Um, there is no new start for this person. This person has created some sort of a criminal activity and people are seeing the truth, what this person has done and how this person has accumulated a whole lot of money. And I see um, that they are going to be taking down both you and this person or this person, you are going to be taking down this person. So I see truths is coming out. So when we look at the energies, the hermit is that someone has used their powers over you. And I see an end is coming into that. And um, some sort of a changes uh, and decision needs to be happened by you, Aries. Whatever the problem is or was, I see some sort of a false play that has created. People are seeing the truth. Um, the arrogancy of how someone used their powers in a situation. I see no start is going to be coming out for some of you and some money needs to return. 
So it's a very, very strong message that is coming up in the first week. The first week of October, people are going to see exactly what was transpired and they're going to be ending it. So people in powers is seeing some sort of a play that some of you Aries have done and they're going to end it directly and make a decision. Um, and they're going to be ruining you basically, whatever the situation is and was, they are going to be taking you down. Um, however, it's transpired. Maybe you or it's the opposite um, energy that is coming up. It is best to ask for the extended reading so you Aries can know whatever is going to be coming up with this extended reading. Then we see um, in the second week, the second week, debt uh, um, directly, a cycle is over and an end has come to the cycle. Whatever that was happening and transpiring, an end has come to the cycle. I see transition is going to be coming up and definitely an end has come to a cycle. People are seeing the um, the situation that was happening and was transpiring. I see the end for an Aquarian, Gemini or Libran. This person have to pay back a whole lot of money. They have seen um, what this person have done and how this person has received a whole lot of money. And I see they're going to be dealing with this person, whoever this person is, maybe it's your child, or maybe there was some sort of a, um, um, a family member or a friend. They are going to be finding out what this person have done and find out the real criminal activity that was going on around this person. And this person is an um, Aquarian, Gemini or Libra um, lady between the ages of 18 and 45. They are going to be finding out what this lady have done and how this lady have acquired a whole lot of money and they're going to be bringing it to an end. So a cycle is going to be over um, for this lady. If there's some sort of a, um, um, information is going to be coming in, I see this lady is totally ruined. Some of you could be dealing um, with this lady, whoever this person is, is a Aquarian, Gemini or a Libra. Then we look at the energy of the Wheel of Fortune in the third week. The Wheel of Fortune is coming in with a judgment call. A judgment call where there is no new start is coming in. I see some sort of a problem, some sort of an issue that is going on. Some sort of a decision needs to be made. Um, no news. Uh, you, Some of you were waiting on some news. There is no news that is coming in. Whoever this lady is, is an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra. And this lady has stolen a lot of money. And I see they are shutting it down. I see they're shutting it down. This was something that this lady has done in the past and people were not aware. The information is coming out. This person um, is a young lady and they are going to be coming down on this person. They saw a huge deceptiveness, what this person has done and what this person has created. And they are really um, taking and making a shift. And I see an end is coming up to this person. So a whole lot of hostility. There's some sort of a deceptive play that was happening. They found out what this lady have done and how this lady has created a whole lot of issue. This person is between the ages of 18 and 45. Then I see the energy of the fool in the um Fourth week and um, the energy of the fool with the star is that some of you have successfully overcome a woman. This woman is an Aquarian, a Gemini or a Libran. And uh, this person is between the ages of 18 and 45. It's a really deceptive person. And I see their ruin because people have found out what this lady, her play and what she did. Um, some of you had hoped for a new start. They're going to be finding out some sort of a deceptiveness that was played and with a whole lot of money. And they're going to be realizing how this deceptiveness has taken place. I see a huge investigation is going on. And they're going to be finding out who this Gemini, Libra or Aquarian is because they are seeing um, that this person has gotten away with a lot of money. I see an end is coming into this person and they are going to be, um, this person is going to be coming up against the law and whoever this person is and how they have acquired this money, they're going to be finding out and they're going to be making sure um, that the money return or um, however it is transpiring. Some of you, this could be a family member. 
A hand is coming in. There's no new start for an Aries, Leo, or Sagittarius person, an Aquarian, Gemini, or Libra person because of some sort of a deceptiveness. A lot of your, this person could be a sister, a family member who have done this injustice. Some of you are caught up with this. Some sort of a decision needs to be made. I see some of um, you or ruin. I see some of you have to return some money. And I see some sort of a transition is here where a whole lot of you, um, there is some sort of a problem, an issue that is going on and a huge investigation that is happening. So be aware. So when we look, um, we see the two of pentacles in reverse. We see the six. Um, there was some sort of a science. Some of uh, you were either using negative forces in order to get something. This is going to be ended. I see the hermit. There is no new start because someone has used their power and no new start is going to come um, up. And I see a whole lot of you have to pay back a whole lot of money. A transition and an end. The cycle is now over for a Pisces and for an Aries, Leo or a Sagittarius, an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra. This comes up as a Libran person um, that an end, a cycle is over for this person. An end is coming in because they have seen the deceptiveness that this person has done in the past and how this person have acquired some sort of a documentation, information in order to give themselves a new story. There will be no new story that is going to be coming in from this person. So I see no new story for an Aquarius that is connected to you guys. No new story for a Gemini that is connected to you guys. No new story for um young people between the, 80, the ages of 18 and 45. So I see truth is going to be coming out about a whole of money. I see some of you who have a child or a friend. Um, there is going to be some sort of a problem. And um, some sort of a information is going to be coming up about some sort of a criminal activity that this person have done. And I see that this person is going to go to jail. Some of you, um, this could be someone who you were associated with. They're going to be finding what this person has done and how this person has acquired a whole lot of money. Um, and this person was using someone else's information and uh, have used someone else um, to get some sort of a pass to get a new start. And they are coming down on this person. So what we see, some of you were using science or um, is uh, accomplished or accommodated by using science. I see this is um, ending. The person who was um, working against you is an Aquarian, Gemini or Libra. I see this person is ruined. Some sort of a decision is going to be made by people in authority about this person and how this person could have acquired all of this in order to do this. And I see this person have to return a whole lot of money. Then we see no new start is coming up. The Wheel of Fortune is bringing no new start for some of you Aries because of some sort of a false height and deceptiveness with a whole lot of money. It is coming out. The cycle is over. A lot of you have to pay back a lot of money and a transition is going to be coming in. And the new start is some of you were hoping for some sort of a new start with your financial stability. Um, it is not going to be coming in because I see a whole lot of issue and a whole lot of problems that came up. So you have to go back and realize because the month is a month of hostility. If you notice, um, information is going to be coming out about people in power and people who have used their powers in the wrong way. A cycle is going to be over, definitely over, um, an end to a situation. Um, and then we see the Wheel of Fortune. This is something that um, this lady has done in the past and now it is coming in and people are finding out what this lady has done. The energy of the fool is um, really a situation where some sort of a transition is going to be coming up, but I see a whole lot of hostility. Family members, if there is happiness, but um, is it really happiness? Because I see a whole lot of family members are going to be having some sort of an issue where you have to make a decision over a situation that is happening and is transpiring because people have seen um, that um, there was some sort of a, some of you tried to ruin a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn. There is where some of you start has tried to ruin 
um, this person and you got ruined yourself. Whether um, this person is a Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn, you have to pay back this person a whole lot of money. Because some of you tried to ruin this person in the past and they have found out what you have done. So it is really a hard month and it's like take the lead, do the right thing. Whatever is happening and transpiring, you've got to take the lead and do the right thing. However, this money is, uh, whoever have taken this money from the Taurus, Virgo or Capricorn person, you have to return the money because I see they find out how you have used this person in order to acquire a lot of uh, wealth and a new start for yourself. And I see it is going to be coming to an end. So be aware of uh, um, this month is a really hostile month. Uh, there is a whole lot of hostility that is coming in from family. And I see you need to make the decision to take the higher ground. However, this is coming up and transpiring. I gotta go. Namaste. Please remember to thumbs up, like, and share these videos. Namaste.